All right, welcome back, my dear students. Edwin from the future again, giving you another great lecture. On today's lecture, we are going to be learning how to read the file. All right, so we already know how to actually open it, create it, and even write to it. But now we need to know how to read it. So let's actually create a new file right here. And as a matter of fact, we can do it from the writing files file. And let's do a save as and let's call this reading files beautiful all right so this is going to be very similar to it but we're going to have to change the w for r and r because that stands for reading and instead of writing we're going to do f read right here and we can save what whatever we got from there into a content variable into a, into a you can name it whatever you want all right and instead of having this as a second parameter, we're going to have the bytes. And now each of these bytes, each byte equals a character. All right, so make sure that you know that. Put a little comment there so you know. So right now we're going to read 10 bytes out of this document right here. All right, and what we can do is we can. Oops, right here. I was I was like, where was I? <laughs> so what we can do is we can do an echo right here so that way we can see it on the screen. All right. So that's all we got to do for here to, uh, for this. To be honest, let's go here and let's refresh. And we see this. It says reading files. Let's go ahead and, and try to read that. All right. It says I love PHP. But if I take this and I say I want to read just two bytes out of it which is two characters I come here and refresh it just reads one byte one character all right so now you might be asking yourselves what if you want to read the whole entire file well you can use a function that will give you the file size and this function name is file size like this this is another built-in function file size PHP has a whole bunch of nice functions right so we can just read the whole file there and now if we come back here refresh we get this and it doesn't matter we can write whatever we want whatever we want and it will read it for us all right there you go see that beautiful so this is how you read a file in PHP all right now keep in mind for those of you that have some type of issue uh, reading this file make sure that you give the right permission to your files sometimes we give the right permission to the folder and then we have a problem when we are reading the file because that that Apache doesn't have permissions to read the the, the file but it but everything should work a hundred percent I already showed you how to go and get the uh, the solution for any permission problem All right. thank you so much for watching this lecture it was a pleasure and I'll see you in the next one take care